Hi there. Are you looking at neighborhoods in St. Louis? My name is Johanna Duran and I'm a realtor with Circa Properties here in beautiful St. Louis, Missouri. And today we are touring the Soulard neighborhood. Soulard is located the absolute farthest east that you can go in St. Louis City. It actually, parts of it, you can see the Mississippi River from. It's just south of downtown and just south of Highway 44 and butts up to Highway 55. So really easy to get all kinds of places. Besides the really good location of Soulard, one of my favorite things about Soulard is the walkability of the neighborhood. It's one of the most walkable neighborhoods in St. Louis City. There are a ton of great bars and restaurants. Um, it's easily accessible to shopping. In fact, several of the Soulard residents you will see own golf carts and um, they use golf carts just to get around to, um, you can get really easily to Bush Stadium. Actually, there's a lot of stuff downtown that you can access pretty easily. Um, I have a couple of clients that live in Soulard that will often take a bird scooter either to a Blues game or a Cardinals game. But you really don't have to go too far just outside of Soulard itself to find um, lots of great things to do. There are wonderful bars and restaurants located throughout Soulard, all walkable to all parts of the neighborhood. On the south side of Soulard is the Anheuser-Busch Brewery, where um, you can take a daily tour, you can go to the restaurant. In the winter, they do their brewery lights. And on the north side of Soulard, you will find the historic Soulard Farmer's Market for just doing grocery shopping, or it's a nice way to spend an afternoon kind of browsing around. One of my other favorite things about Soulard is the architecture. So as you can see, there is a ton of fabulous St. Louis red brick. And most of the buildings are going to be anywhere from two to three stories. They are just gorgeous. I mean, the, the details in how they built these properties way back when, um, you just don't really find much like that anymore. There's a lot of French influence in the architecture of Soulard, uh, mostly because of the settlers in St. Louis at the very beginning were mostly French. So um, there's a large French influence in a lot of the architecture in Soulard, which is really nice. A lot of the properties in Soulard you will find we'll have smaller yards. Um, there are alleys, so there are going to be detached garages in the back. Um, and that's not to say all of them are going to have smaller yards. There are lots of properties that um, either may be a double lot or on a corner lot that are going to have a bigger yard with more space available. There is a really nice, diverse um, selection of housing in Soulard. So lots of single family homes, but also lots of condos and apartments. So um, there's something available for everybody. There has been a lot of new construction over the last 10 to 15 years in Soulard. And St. Louis City does a great job with their historic districts to make sure that any new construction really adheres to historic standards so that you don't have anything sticking out like a store thumb that wasn't built to look like what the rest of the neighborhood looks like. Generally, you can get anywhere from a two to four bedroom home in the Soulard neighborhood for somewhere in the low two, say like 225 up to the 400,000 range. There are lots of options though for much bigger, grander homes um, that will go anywhere up to eight or 900,000. And also lots of options for condos that are gonna be in the low to mid hundreds. No video about Soulard would be complete without mentioning a Mardi Gras celebration in Soulard. St. Louis absolutely prides itself on its Mardi Gras celebration. I am told it is the second biggest Mardi Gras celebration in the country. If you have more questions about the Soulard neighborhood or any other neighborhoods in St. Louis, please don't hesitate to reach out. I'm always happy to help point people in the right direction as far as St. Louis neighborhoods. And I would love it if you would subscribe down below. I put out new videos every week and thank you so much for watching.